In this problem, we're asked to come up with a confidence interval for the mean fat content of a particular type of low-fat hot dogs. Our formula for a confidence interval looks like this. We just need to fill in the missing values and simplify. So our first step, we need to figure out what x bar is, and this is just the sample mean for our sample. So here's our 10 uh, fat contents for the 10 hot dogs in the sample we've got. The average can be just calculated by Excel, it's nice and easy and we get 19.7 grams on average, so write that right there. Uh, next up is Z star, and remember we have this formula from lecture that uh, allows us to compute Z star very easily, so it's just minus norms inv, and then it's 1 minus C, C is the confidence level, so in this case we've got a 95 percent confidence level, so this is going to be 0.95, and uh, we can just ask Excel for this, so if we come back over here say equal minus norms env and it's 1 minus 0.95 divided by 2 and we get well 1.95996 that's really close to 1.96 which is the standard number used in connection with a 95 percent confidence interval so we'll say that this here is equal to just 1.96 the other ingredients are easier to pick up. We're told in the problem that the standard deviation is 3 and we've got a sample of size 10. So we're ready to go now. All we have to do is plug into this formula. So we've got 19.7 plus or minus 1.96 times a sigma. So 3 divided by the square root of 10. And this is 19.7 and if we actually compute this, combine it all together, it turns out to be uh, 1.8594. I'm just carrying lots of decimal places so that there won't be any issues with web work. And then in interval notation, 19.7 minus this 1.8594 turns out to be equal to 17.8406. And if we instead take 19.7 plus 1.8594, that gives the upper limit of the interval, which turns out to be 21.5594. And there we have it.